YouTube. <laughs> it's Dina B from Let's Try and See. And this is a look I came up with on a whim. Um, we're going out tonight. It is date night. And I was excited. So I decided I was going to film a get ready with me. And this is the look that I came up with. And I shot a continuous video that I am going to chop and screw so that it's not 45 minutes long like it really is. So, <laughs> on to the video. I hope you enjoy it. Before you go, though, don't forget to subscribe. Thank you. Okay, so we are starting off with our brows already done and we're going to go into our Juvia's Place Magic Palette and we're grabbing Kesey and we're going to create a base here. And this is going to be my routine from now on, basically starting with our brows and starting with a white base, which is Kesey from the Juvia's Place Magic Palette. And um, my reason for that is because it makes it easier for the other colors to show up more brightly. So that's why we're going with that. And I love this palette, guys. Like, it's so bomb. Oh my God, it's so bomb. But yeah, so next step, we're gonna grab a fluffy brush and we're gonna go in and grab Zakaya. That's our home girl. And we're gonna start with our transition color here. Now, this look only has a few colors in it, y'all. It's only a couple colors, so. This might be y'all's go too if y'all want to use something that looks fancy, but it really isn't. So there we are breaking out that that great Zakaya, that transition transition shade. What was I looking at? I don't know. Um, but we're gonna do that. And once we got Zakaya in really, really good, we're gonna go to our next color on the Juvia's Place Magic Palette. And that color, it's gonna be Asia, which is really nice. I'm doing the most with everything, I'm sorry guys. But yeah, we got Asia. And then we're gonna sweep that kinda just over the mobile lid area into the crease a little bit. And we're gonna do that on both eyes. I am like hauling ass because I'm running late, so I apologize on why it looks like I'm going even faster than I usually go. Because when I tell you, I was like, what, we're going out? Hell yeah, let me hurry up and get dressed. So I was like, ooh, 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 let me shoot a video. So I was trying to do the most, so I apologize for that. And then our next color is, I think is Yayide, because I couldn't see what I grabbed there. I apologize for that, but um, it's Yayide. Basically just darkening up our smoky eye. When I tell you, I'm gonna need all my subscribers to go grab these palettes. Like, a lot of people have been complaining about Juvia's Place customer service and Juvia's Place um, tracking. I never had any problems with Juvia's Place having any issues. Oh, my contact just went completely left. Um, I, I've ordered two palettes from them already and I have not had any problem. Tracking has been fine, shipping has been fine, got the um, palettes fine so I don't know what kind of issues they were having before but they are not having those issues anymore so get you guys a palette guys don't miss out and they're having crazy sales right now I just bought the, the Nubian 2 palette for 20 bucks and okay so that gold color is Baruno Baron, Baranu um, let me jump back into my <laughs> I almost went off on a rant for a second but that gold color is Baranu and it is quite lovely and slid on like butter. When I tell you it went on like butter, easy peasy, beautiful Nigerian girl, okay? <laughs> but yeah, it went on really nice. And those are pretty much all my colors. Like I did not do anything else other than that. Then um, I'm looking, looking, looking like, hmm, what else do I need? Oh, so I grabbed Kesey and I just basically tightened up my um, eyebrow, my brow bone right there to brighten it up, and um, yeah, 
pretty much done with that. And then I clean up my eyebrows. Then I go ahead and start with my liner. And I use that felt tip magic marker type liner. <laughs> it's not a magic marker, but it looks like it. And then um, after that, I think I just jump right into my foundation. Sorry about that guys once you get your liner on you have to dance a little and then you put your mascara on <laughs> I'm like sheesh but yeah get our mascara on really really good because we can't have mascara on without lashes because you know any fallout that might have coated our lashes we got to go ahead and clean that up so next step would be foundation and so we're going to use our Maybelline Superstay 24 hour long wear foundation in the color 356 warm coconut. And we're going to get that all over our face really, really nice. And this is the same makeup routine I use any other day. So we do our foundation first and then we go in there with our powder. So that's what you see here. So I'm going to grab my Maybelline um, Age Rewind Foundation and we're going to blend, not foundation, I'm so sorry, concealer, and we're going to blend that in. Here we go. Going to get our Yeah. I started blending that in with the beauty blender because I think my concealer brush done got dirty somehow. And so now I'm going over it with my, um, it's another Maybelline concealer to kind of fix that because I messed it up with a dirty concealer brush. I apologize, y'all. So then when we're going to blend that out with a beauty blender. Baby, basically cut to the chase and use that beauty blender if you notice how beautiful and large and fluffy fluffy this beauty blender is it's because it is the real techniques body blender found at Ulta y'all need to go get you one that thing is the bomb it is super posh when I tell you it is super posh oh my goodness so then we're gonna go into our black opal powder no, we're going to use our HD banana powder first. My apologies. I don't even know my own routine. Um, we did this. I did this just to basically brighten things up. But then I'm going to go over it with my um, powder from Black Opal in medium. There it goes. So I, every time I see myself doing my foundation and doing my, my um, highlight with this color, like... Ugh. So good. Love that shizno. Love that shizno. And then that's what you see me doing here is giving it a brush with my very large fluffy brush. Um, it's an equate brush. It was only five bucks at Walmart, so I was trying it out. I liked how everything came out. Do my little last touch-ups. Going from there, and then what's the next step? Oh yeah, I noticed that my foundation was breaking up a little bit on my nose. Like that's new. Didn't know what the hell was going on with that. I don't know if it was like this, um, just my skin tripping. I don't know. But then I got my ankle fluffy brush and started to contour. And I used my beautiful pressed powder from Black Radiance and in the color Rich Mahogany. So I'm contouring to the gods. Yes. Yes, child. <laughs> so silly. 
So then, boom, I got my lashes on, and we are killing the game. So we got our lashes on, and I'm like, okay, so the next thing I need to do is we're going to try this duo. This duo sucks. Do not buy this. I'm, You know, matter of fact, I'm not even going to tell y'all what kind of duo it was. Like, it's so bad. So we're not even, we're going to act like I'm not even doing anything right now. This duo did not show up in my skin. <laughs> I just had to work hard to make it any do anything so yeah we're gonna stay away from this duo so I'm trying to find something else and this whole scenario could have went left really bad when you buy cheap makeup guys and stuff doesn't turn out the way you want like it can end up making your makeup look go left really really quickly so here I am trying to fix that I finally grabbed my um eyeshadow that i like from sephora and you see how pink my lips my my cheeks look now and then i'm going back in with my black radiance to try to like fix it then i'm grabbing cafe from black radiance to try to clean that up and tone all that down but like i said like the struggle is real when you're trying to find good makeup for a decent price you end up buying some too cheap makeup and it's like terrible so there i am going over everything and i'm liking it so i'm like all right so the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna check out these lips here. I'm gonna start lining our lips. I'm gonna line our lips with this nice brown lip liner. Yes, girl. You know what, I wish I, you know whose lips I wish I had? Um, either Rihanna or Ellery. They have some bomb ass lips, y'all. Like, my lips are like some, I don't know. They're, they're not Rihanna's lips, you know? I'm gonna eat Rihanna's lips. <laughs> okay, I'm not like Kylie. I'm not gonna go buy some lips, but I'm just saying. Lips are bomb. So, what I'm gonna use is my go to baby doll face lip gloss. And there we go. We're about to be done. There we go. And that's how I got ready for my date. And. <laughs> I stole his towel. <laughs> I hope you like it. I hope you enjoy it. You guys have a wonderful night and enjoy your weekend. I'm going out. <laughs>